Hello world, this is the Hacker Triple O Seven, and today I'm doing a Komodo Ice Dragon video review, which is a more secure version of Firefox. Now, at the exact same time this video came out, a Komodo Internet Browser came out, or a video review on that, which is the Google Chrome version, which I will show you guys quickly. Um, if you want to see a more in-depth review, um, you guys can go into the link in the description below and see that. But basically, it is a more secure version of Google Chrome. This is it right here, guys. So, if you guys want to see a whole thing with this, you guys can go ahead and click on the video description below. Today, I'll be doing a review on the Ice Dragon setup, which is this one right here. Um, what it is 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 basically the exact same thing as uh, the Dragon, except that it is built on Firefox. So, this is for people who prefer Firefox over Google Chrome. So just go through, it has a pretty simple setup. And it, it will start to install for you. And I'm doing the uninstall process, it will copy all its files that it needs to run. And it will also import whatever you decided to import. I skipped that step because my computer was glitching up a bit, sorry about that. And now we can see that it was just importing. Um, Telling us our output folder as it's just about finishing up the setup file, and then we'll run the Ice Dragon for the first time and see uh, what it looks like. So this is an option um, to sign up for their newsletters via email address. It is optional, so you don't have to do that. If you don't want to, just click Next. Last but not least is to run the program. So. Uh, So let's click finish and it'll start the program for you. And this is Komodo Ice Dragon. So the major differences don't appear um, from the looks of it. Um, basically what it is is it is the way it's built in. So from the outside it doesn't look like anything uh, has changed much except for things like uh, the home has been changed to something I actually like where you have a direct links to uh, things like settings, Firefox add-ons, the add-on manager, um, history, bookmarks, and downloads. And then of course we have the Google Chrome or the Google uh, search. So we'll just see how that looks. Now we have the default search. So uh, it looks pretty fast. It looks like normal uh, other one there. We have a uh, flash. You can see it working fine. Um, scrolling looks pretty good so no problems there again guys there are ma mo mo major differences are not in the uh, appearances of it um, you guys can see that nothing has much changed the only major difference in the uh, settings is the in the privacy tab you guys can tell you have the option to tell websites that do not want to be tracked so things like Google etc etc will not track you um, another thing they have built into here is the uh, DNS protection so that um, what viruses and websites cannot attack your DNS, change the codes, or say change the numbers, for example, and uh, control where you go on the, on the internet. So that's about it, guys. Um, one last thing that they have built in here is you can actually click this little button in the corner and it will take the website that you're on and put it through a scan using their website. Now once you put it through the scan you will you can tell whether or not um, it's an approved so we'll, just go, we'll go here to the default Google and run it. So it's saying that our scans are running so it's going to go through and scan it. I will pause the video until it's done. So it only took a couple seconds guys and you guys can see that it's telling us it's safe from all kinds of things like that. It tells us that our scanned IP, it tells us everything. So that's all good. So if we were to go things like YouTube and scan that, it will actually report, it will actually tell us things like the, the uh, register date, 
renewal date of their domain, um, technical contacts, everything like that. So that's about it, guys, for this uh, review. Again, if you want to check out the uh, Firefox or sorry, the Google Chrome version of the software, you guys can go to the description below and click on that video. Besides that, guys, have a great day. Don't don't forget to subscribe, comment, and rate, and uh, give this video a thumbs up. This is the Hacker Triple O Seven, and I'm signing off.